Now our first alert forecast on this Thursday morning, seeing the clouds well offshore, they're moving away. So we've got uh, sunshine that's going to be around today. Beautiful weather on Tybee this morning. Lower 40s along our entire coastline of Georgia and into South Carolina. Pretty chilly for inland areas at low to mid 30s from Swainsboro over to Statesboro. So definitely needing that jacket as we get out the door this morning. We see those clouds on the satellite moving away. The rain is out of here. Clear skies will be around here for the rest of today with that wind coming out of the west and northwest 5 to 10 miles an hour for many of us. That's adding a little chill to the air this morning. Feels like 30 in Swainsboro. Feels like 35 in Savannah, 38 in Beaufort, and it feels like 41 right now. And just up for Savannah temperatures near 40 for the next couple of hours. Lots of sunshine around for the next uh, few days. We're going to have a decent weather until we get to Saturday. So let's get to today first. We got those damp roads still out there, but they are drying. We've got sunshine throughout the afternoon highs in the 50s. A nice evening ahead through the next few days. As mentioned, pretty nice weather today and tomorrow. Saturday morning, though, rain chance uh, for just about everybody. Good coverage of rain comes into play on Saturday morning. With that, also seeing a chance for some stronger storms, especially south of Savannah, closer to the Altima Hall River. So let's take a look at Saturday satellite radar. Seeing the rain move in here before sunrise for some of our western areas. This is at 3 in the morning on Saturday. So if you have Friday night plans going into Saturday morning, we're going to start getting wet. Friday night looks good, though. Stopping this at 6 o'clock, a little interesting uh, little feature here. Could have some stronger storms there moving from Douglas to Jessup to Brunswick and Waycross. Watching that area for your Saturday morning along the coastline, still seeing showers around at daybreak. Again, some of these could be on the stronger side, but not seeing a big severe event for Saturday. By 10 o'clock, we see a lot of this work up the coast and away from us. So the rest of our Saturday nights looks pretty good Sunday as well. Monday starts off dry, but then more rain comes in going into Tuesday. So let's talk about Tuesday. It is now a first alert weather day. Getting a little better picture as we get closer for the organized severe weather event that is possible. Looking at a chance for tornadoes during the daytime on Tuesday. I know it's a ways out. It's only Thursday, but first alerting you to that. The heavy rain going to be around as well as wind gusts over 30 miles an hour, maybe even not even associated with thunderstorms. So pretty uh, windy as we get into our Tuesday. As a note, as we get into Saturday, still could have wind gusts over 25 with those showers coming on through. We've got more for you guys coming up after the break.